Good morning everyone. It is 8.20 which is uh, pretty early because today is a Sunday. But I have a date with my friend who just came back from Korea after a month. We are going to go see the cherry blossom at UW. So that's why I'm up very early right now, trying to get ready. Okay, I finished getting ready and here's my outfit of the day. This is just a off-the-shoulder top with dress pants. Pretty simple. Hi mom! Hey. This is such a mom car too. <laughs> That's the biggest dude in the moment. Oh, you brought an actual camera? <laughs> They're everywhere. Yeah, it wasn't a good time. Should we? Yeah, yeah I, like I like this that. one too, actually. Yeah, this one's cute. And then we can do one with props. grocery shopping, buy a cake, and um, we're gonna have steak for dinner tonight. Yes. And I think that I know you don't like it. Am I master chef or what? I'm not doing it well. They're doing so much better in master chef, babe. Okay, I am a little bit late, but I have to go to my yoga class now. This is my outfit of the day. Both bra and leggings are from Lululemon. So I'll see you guys later. Into your turbo tax, right?
Flowers follow me. This is my lunch. We have rice. This is beef stir fry with bean sprouts and um, so the cabbage that I really need to finish. I am so sleepy. I will do makeup for a bit and then go back to work. <laughs> I'm also going to UW today again to meet up with my friend Jason and I think we are going to take some cherry blossom photos and then go for dinner. First of all, sunscreen. I got the round lap sunscreen and this one is cushion kind of type. I also have like the tube kind but I don't know where it went. I have been feeling extra lonely ever since coming back to Seattle too because when I was in Vietnam, I would have friends and we could, would go out almost every other day. But that's just simply not the case like for me here. First of all, I went to a very small college and thus the only person that I know who went to the same college with me here is Leo. And then we started working and all the work is remote. It, I mean, it's remote if you want to be. Even if you go into the office, which is what I did for the first few months, there's nobody in the office. It was quite lonely and I just really miss you know the joy of having friends going shopping going to a ca nice cute cafe shop just like chit chat gossip and I wanted to be able to do that but finding a community here is really hard I don't see my friends often at all if anything I think I see them once every three months and that's already like a stretch like I don't see them that much so I guess that's adult life but I still don't really like it now that I work a 9 to 5 and work has been really busy like all I do is get out of bed go straight to my desk to work and then end work when like it's already dark and I'm already exhausted from working the whole day so overall it's not the best but it is what it is and we gotta deal with it so on Sunday I begged my friend Emily to hang out with me for a little bit and then Jason just got back from his trip so I asked if he wanted to hang out and he said yes one of my goals for this year I really truly want to find a community where I can hang out with but I don't know I don't 
like I work in tech and I don't think people in tech have the same kind of interest as me like of course like going hiking and everyone in Washington does that but you know like interest about yoga working out or my fashion going shopping I don't think a lot of people in tech do that and it kind of makes me sad a little bit because I really really like shopping with my friends in Vietnam like even in college I have friends that I can hang out with and because we are a very small college so it's required that everyone lives on campus for all four years and hanging out with a friend is so easy I was living with my friends we, I was joining a um, sorority and we can see friends every single day so when I first moved here it was it was really hard to accept that I have to live alone and I won't be able to hang out with my friends as often anymore and this is not to say that I don't do anything with Leo but sometimes I just want friends outside of the relationship and that is just hard when you're an adult I don't know did I get paler? I look like an orange like the bronzer that I've been using it looks a little bit too yellow that's very weird I have been learning how to do fake lashes and honestly, it is one of the hardest things. I watched so many tutorials on TikTok and every tutorial has a different way of doing it. So I don't even know if I'm doing it correctly or not. Apparently the trick is you have to let it dry for 30 seconds first. Oh. Anyways, I, guys, as I'm saying, it's very important to find an extroverted friend. Jason has invited me to so many trips that he planned and thanks to him I've known so many people I'm a, and I'm very thankful for that. I think he's like the perfect friend. But having an extroverted friend can only save you so much. You also have to start reaching out on your own and ask the friends to hang out with you try making it like a cadence like once a month or like me once every three months I want to try to hang out with my friends more but I know they're very busy and so I want to try joining some clubs my goal for this year is to find a community where I can hang out with uh, at least once a month yeah I've been looking at reading clubs because I love reading but these days I've been very busy but I also am looking at um, grad school classes because we have UW here and we can take classes there. I hope that it's in person actually. I really want to attend in-person classes just so I can hang out with other people. Let's try to not feel as lonely as adults. Okay, here's my makeup for the day, not my best work. I think this is going to be my outfit of the day. Just simple, nice blouse with black jeans.
This is bean sprouts. Just add any veggies that you want. Pepper flake. Last but not least, soy sauce. 